So the next step in painting the living room will be to uh, patch up the trim work. Um, we've created some holes, as you can see, uh, when we removed the uh, hardware. So we want to get that nice and smooth. Um, the tools we'll be using include, you know, a scraper. Um, I've got some sandpaper here, my dust mask, and of course the actual patching material. So I'm going to put my mask and take my scraper. And there's, you don't really have to, there's not too much that needs to be scraped as it were. You just want to get rid of some of this old paint that's chipping. Anywhere you see chipping. These particular windows are in pretty good shape. So that's about the extent of that. And then I'm going to take my sandpaper and go over those areas with it. And that should do it. I recommend using like 100C sandpaper, or maybe even 150, 120, somewhere around there. So, now that those areas are smoothed out, we're going to take our patching material. As you can see, it's got a nice consistency to it. grab a glob of it and just apply it in the areas that we removed the hardware from. We'll be sanding this down once it dries so don't worry about it being too chunky. Don't be afraid to use your fingers. It's water soluble so it'll come right off. And that should do it. This will take about an hour to set up. And as I said, once, once it's dry, we can go ahead and sand it again and smooth it out even farther.